Dare I ask how big is your iguana? <laughs> so Jack, I've been having some trouble with the ladies lately. I'm gonna try going to an old age Tinder yeah. website. I think older people will like you as well. I'm an old soul. Aren't yeah, I? yeah, I do yeah, like I always really get well with old people. Yeah, she was dead. Cousins here too. Are you having some whiskey in your underwear? <laughs> <laughs> Number <laughs> Friday. <laughs> okay, I am looking. Or a woman. In order for me to find the best matches for you, can you let me know your date of birth? Okay. I reckon say you're 58. No, <laughs> <Yes>. 62. <laughs> okay. Did you actually? What? Yeah. What? What about 1975? Do you like the 1975? I was literally just listening to their song on the way here. Yeah, I like the band. Somebody else 1975. Is very sad, so that's. Oh shit! This red. Okay. So this website is dedicated to people over 50. Are you not 50 if you're born in 1975? 25 plus 18? No, you're just shy. So we'll go 1970. It says, so young. <laughs> what city do you live in? Well, you good. live in Kent. Look, looks good. You guys are in focus now. <laughs> oh, oh wait, what, we went in focus? Yeah. No, I'll um, <laughs> 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 run out of focus. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, Casper's really got nothing to do today, has <laughs> he? <laughs> Oh, don't focus! I like it. This is the Casper you get on holiday. <laughs> you know, when he's been there for a couple of days. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we're right in the middle oh, of this. funny, that's funny. No, Let's just no keep, just... you live in Shrewsbury. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Shrewsbury, where is that? It's Shrewsbury, UK. I love this area. You f***ing liar, no you don't. <laughs> Whoops! Oh, almost got to ask, are you a man or a woman? Oh, man. Can you choose a username? It's best to keep it short and sweet. Charles. What about Leslie? Charles. We use my dad's name. <laughs> yeah, we use dad's name. <laughs> Leslie. I found singles in I can't imagine there are many singles in Shrewsbury. Yeah, well, that's where you're wrong. <laughs> Here we go. Oh. Are you ready to enter a new relationship? Tonight? Should we go? Let's see what happens. Yeah. Because, like, you might want to. Yeah, but might get casual. Cheap. What is my relationship status? Just do you never marry. Never marry. Yeah, yeah. Make sound like a bit of a playboy. Do I have children? Yes, we'll say Casper's my child. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> How tall are you? You oh, are oh. nine foot. <laughs> You say the max six foot seven. <laughs> Tall old boy. Hair short. Cause they're gonna see that. Um, Auburn. It, red. Yes. It, <laughs> you sure it's not like blonde? No, it's, it's it's red. Okay, fine. Nationality. Let's go South African. Yes. Yes. Okay. What is your religion? Agnostic. Okay. Open to the concept of religion, but not entirely convinced by it. Okay, show us your best smile, all right. So originally we were going to use this app to try and make me look older, but then we were scared that that wouldn't look realistic enough. So in the end, we just went onto Facetune and tried to make me look as old as possible. Um, I'll do one on you. Oh, just to test it. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we need you to look old, not young. We need to sort your hair out. Okay, I literally do not turn my... Okay. I can see why. Get the long bits the other way. No, that's wrong. Then the short parts of your hair go there. Yeah, there you go. Oh, there's a long bit. You look like Draco Malfoy. <laughs> cool. Beautiful. <laughs> the first one, you're, the first one is actually amazing. Let's have a look at my uh, my profile. We've got obviously the photos here, which are top draw. Uh, Jack Maynard, face tune editing there. That's. <laughs> Absolute quality, isn't it? <laughs> now you literally look like an old man there. Hi there, my name is Leslie. First time on a site like this, sorry if I'm nervous. My hobbies include bowls, golf, and of course, lasso it. <laughs> uh, pets, obviously. Exotic <laughs> animals. Yeah, income, that's very important. Yeah, more, more than, than 150 grand a year, you are a rich bastard. Yeah, that's what we want. And then preferences, honestly, I'll take anything I can get. Yeah, I don't want to lead anyone on too much. Because that would be a bit mean. Yeah, that's a bit snide, isn't it? Uh, so I'm just going to have some conversations with some people. And basically, I can't believe that I've got any matches based on the profile. you got quite a few. I know, we've been doing okay. So let's go through them. Then there was something wrong with this dating website where it would auto-correct things you were saying when they didn't need to be auto-corrected. So a lot of the time, especially with the people I was talking to, the stuff they were saying... They weren't checking before they were sending the messages. So it did happen to me a couple of times, but you'll see a lot of the messages I receive are rather confusing. Okay, here we've got Linda, 68 years old. She's looking for someone who is widowed. Separated or divorced. <laughs> what? Okay. I guess she wants someone who's shown that they can commit. Oh God, he has a problem. Hair color preference, white, blonde or dark brown. Yours is red. 
Yeah. Anyway, let's see what she has to say. So Linda says, you're young. Is that a good thing? She's not sure. Do you really live in Shrewsbury? <laughs> yeah, what about you? Yep, but do not want to give up their whereabouts. Thought I was talking to someone in Scotland, but he was in Turkey. Did he get out? I don't know, I left him there. In the turkey? Yeah, back from the shop with the weekend spy of Sauvignon Blanc and all manner of healthy slash unhealthy supplies. Naughty with a wink. Oh no, I can be naughtier than that. I resisted the strawberry truffle and ice cream. <laughs> oh dear, good job though. Not sure, but I'm lusting after some strawberry truffle. Trifle. Some strawberry trifle. Oh my god, mate. And you're a bit of strawberry. And, uh, oh, do you, do you, think you can be saying? Doing some cooking, a very rare occurrence. Fancy some roast chicken, not turkey, and healthy trimmings. Dot, 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 dot. And ice cream. What's your favourite type of ice cream? Salted caramel. So delicious. I think you're delicious. Really? Why? Sorry, Sorry my cat's. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my cat stood on my keyboard. Type what? There? <laughs> yeah, I know, she's crazy, my cat. I don't like cats, I'm asthmatic. Yeah, I hate my cat, he's a little <laughs> Have you seen Joe Sugg on Strictly Come Dancing? <laughs> not sure who he is though. P.S. Is your cat a hermaphrodite? She chooses not to identify. <laughs> Sandy, 68 years old. Wow, she doesn't look 68. No, she looks like it's not a day over 35. So because her name's Sandy, obviously opened up with the classic, I like the beach. What? Beach? <laughs> <laughs> get it? Because your name's Sandy. Yes, of course. I get Sandy Shaw. Ah, <laughs> yes. What's the craziest thing you've ever done in the name of love? Sailed a couple of months ago with a cup. <laughs> I sailed a couple of months ago with a couple of months ago. It was time for you to drift with the wind. And how would you go to find it? I. Do you know what? Okay. I don't have a f clue what that sentence. So, uh, believe it or not, we matched with someone named Duck Down. Duck Down. I think some of the older folk on the internet are like very worried about their personal yeah, security they think, compromise. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, oh my god, if I put my name's Jan, they're gonna find out where I live and kill me. Duck Down, how's it going? It's going good. My gosh, you're a tall person. Six foot seven, I'm a tiny five foot two. And what an income! 150k a year? And tropical animals? Dare I ask how big is your iguana? My god, she's a flirtatious oh my god, beast. She's a flirt. My salary is actually more, but I couldn't put in any more than 150k. My iguana, however, is disappointingly small. Refreshing to have an honest person on the side. Guess the ladies are queuing up for a single man with cash flow. Unscrupulous. Unscrupulous as they be. Well, you'd be. Yeah. <laughs> yes, indeed. It's not about how big your iguana is, but rather how you use it. And if there was a tail, I'd say you'd most definitely have a fast pass. I meant to say, if there was a cue, because she said, Yeah, yeah, no, I know. Ha, ha, ha. I meant the tail would be for the cash. That would be the real attraction for them. I said agreed. So how did you get the name Duck Down? Intrigued, though. It's connected to my training with NLP. No, what's NLP? Neuro Linguistic Programming. It's connected to my training with NLP. So it's a protective layer of a duck, duck down. down, down, wrapped round that person so it cannot be so it cannot be done. It gets the chance to get it, get it, get it, <laughs> unless that mind or body lets it in. So nothing like you may have assumed it. Oh, okay. I made a video called Poo <laughs> 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 oh dear. Okay. Yeah, I didn't do much. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, you know the drill. We're still on the road to one million. Yeah, we are. Woo! Jack's one million some... merch sales. Come on. Do you have a link for your merch? I can, I can oh, I up. do. Oh. I do. It is um, it is headline merch. Headlinesmerch.com. Check it out. I haven't received mine yet, but it's in the post. I hear. It's coming on Monday. Anyway, all the best, guys. See ya.